Welcome, welcome back. I hope everybody's doing good out there today. Um, today I'm going to be listening to some more Seven Spires with their song Gods of Debauchery. This was requested by Matt Allen and Marco Varg. Now, I was told that this one is much more aggressive, much more guttural um, from, from Adriana. I'm really excited to see what she does with this. Uh, I've really enjoyed the songs I've done with her so far. They, they are fantastic. Um, and I'm anxious to see what they're going to be doing. I'm um, waiting for news for the front of the drummer. And then definitely I'm looking forward to any tour they're going to be doing. This is one of the few bands that's actually from the States um, that, I, uh, that I've discovered on my own channel. They're just, they're up in Boston, which is, I mean, it's still a pretty good chunk away from here, but it's not, you know, across the, you know, on the other side of the country, so hopefully they'll get touring and come down near me, I'd love to see these guys They're really good. Um, real quick, I do have a Patreon, uh, link will be down in the description. Most of my reaction videos go up there at least a day in advance. Um, also, if you're in the leads tier, you get two... Patreon shout out requests every month. Um, doesn't matter what it is, doesn't matter how obscure it is. If you love it, I want to hear it. Um, it's been a great way that I've found some really great bands, um, great new bands, and a few gr great older bands that I didn't know about. So I'm, I've really enjoyed that. If you want to um, donate a little bit more directly, I do have a, my PayPal and my Cash App down in the description. Or you can use the Super Thanks um, through. I really appreciate everything y'all have done for me. It really is amazing. I can't thank you guys enough. Um, but I'm excited for this. So let me switch over. And let's get started. So here we go. Seven Spires, Gods of Debauchery. This is the official music video. Uh. Germans are already at their doorstep. Sorry about this. There's no reason. Sorry about that. Um, it's a longer video, so I guess it's going to have an ad in it. Um, let's go ahead and start about talk about the beginning part. Um, really interesting vocals. Her, she's got such a great voice, but she's singing super low and almost like a drone. It's sent so much. Um, atmosphere to the to what's going to be coming and then when the music started coming in i was trying to figure out what that first long note i was hearing is it almost sounded like um kind of like a bagpipe maybe or it could have been a guitar with with a filter on it or a, an effect on it but it, it definitely felt like a like a horn of some sort whether um whether uh bagpipe or maybe it was like a double reeded like a, a um, bassoon or an oboe or something but it just sounded def definitely sounded unusual and then the drum the snare drum with the rolls coming out and just the the orchestration coming in very cool um so much atmosphere in this i'm really enjoying this let's hope there's no more ads Again. It's a 
too steady for that. Let's discuss the her her vocals continue that low droney section, and then this chant came in, um, male voices chanting is is on the studio or is that the guys in the band or is that a separate choir that they use uh, along with their music? Very curious about that, but it was a cool chant. And then the drummer, um, Chris, came in with this really cool feel. And then he, it was like a, a very intense but short feel that he repeated a few times. And then um, Jack and Peter came in and matched him. And it was still this short, intense, you know, just little bits of music and then silence, bits of music and silence. That was building up the intensity, building up the um, the um, God, I can't think of the word. I'm so bad. I'm, I hate when I lose words, but it's just just bringing up that intensity and um, the tension, the tension that it was bringing up. Very cool. Um, and then they just hit it and were just jamming. That guitar solo section, loved that. And his guitar. I wish I, I, I could stop on the actual guitar. The body of the paint drop on that guitar. That right there, that, of course I missed it. That, his paint job, that is amazing. That is beautiful. And I do like that bass too. But let's go ahead and get back into it. was intense wow um she has great growls and screams it's crazy how good she is at that i apologize for wiping my nose all and it's 
the allergies have hit and my nose is just itchy. I don't know. It's, it's not running. I'm not having to you know, run and blow my nose every five seconds, but my nose is itchy. So I apologize for constantly you know, doing that. Um, but anyways, her vocals are so intense and so impressive. Those growls and screams just hit you in the face. And then she is so good at it. The band, when they went, they, when they kicked in after that, um, slower guitar lead section, just all out, flat out, badass. Oh, that was fucking cool. <laughs> and then they, they, they brought it down to halftime and just was, oh, it's just so good. This band is fan fucking tastic. I love this band. <laughs> Sorry for cussing. <laughs> Sometimes I just, I, I try my best not to curse on, on this channel. Um, I curse enough outside of the videos, so I try to keep it clean in the videos because my, my kids actually watch my videos, which is really cool. But occasionally, I can't help it. I have to. <laughs> it just comes out because this is badass. This is so cool. that was cool because even when she used her cleans it was still distorted um which was a great um juxtaposition with the screams and gutturals um very cool what chris is doing on those drums is fantastic he is just a badass drummer um god i've heard um you guys told me that when he left seven spires he's now drumming for testament which is a band i know from back in the 80s i wasn't there were a band that was just on the outside of the bands that i was listening to i would catch some of their songs and stuff some of the i think I even i had one of their albums back in the 80s or early 90s so i don't even know much about them as far as especially not currently but if he's gone to testament testament has gotten a fantastic drummer and i, I can't wait to see what seven spires brings in for their drummer but that whole drum section was badass. Jack, he's an amazing guitarist. I know I, I keep just, I'm just glowing and, you know, they're great, they're great, they're great. But they are. I, I, I can't fake it. I can't, it's not like he's a bad guitarist. I'm like, oh, I'll pretend he's good. He's obviously amazing. And I love what he's doing. And that bass, 
Peter's amazing too. I love that six string bass. It's beautiful. And he is just killing it. He hasn't gotten any, like some other bands that I listen to, the bass is like almost leading a lot of the stuff. He's down underneath, keeping the song together, doing what basses usually do, but he's doing it really well. And of course, Adriani, um, I, I'm having trouble pronouncing her name. Because normally that would be, when I see that name, I see the E's as A's. So I, I'm trying to say her name. Adrienne? Adrian? Is it Adrian if just the last E is silent? Let me know how, how to pronounce her name. But she is a, I love her singing. I love her energy. How, what she brings to this band is absolutely amazing. And I heard a lot of background keyboards and stuff and on the wiki it says that she's vocals and keyboards i'm assuming she does all the keys and it's pre-recorded for their live but is are there any songs that she does like piano live on stage or is it all she does it all in the studio and then they use it as a backing track just i'm just curious um i'd love to see something live where she's playing um where she's playing live there was i did a video i can't remember the name of it but one of their videos where she was sitting at a piano playing it while she was singing with a guest singer um i'm wondering if she does stuff like that live but just interesting just just curious but um i'm loving this song this is really good <laughs> ended that with the echo very cool okay so that was seven spires with um gods of debauchery that was amazing that was badass these this band is so freaking good um the god i can't wait for them to start touring i need them to get a new drummer and get on the road if you guys are listening to me and um adrian did comment on first time first song of theirs i did if you if, if you watch this come to sit east tennessee please i will be front row center i cannot wait to see you guys play wow that was fantastic i really enjoyed that um that was and i was told that this was going to be more of her gutturals and it was basically the whole song just the, the intro kind of low drone atmospheric um section and then there's that one short section where she was just clean with some distortion. But other, otherwise, she was pure gutturals and screams the whole song. And she was badass at it. 
really enjoyed that. That was a great song. I really enjoyed that. If you guys liked it, give it a like. Comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell. Um, if I can get you to do me a favor, just go down into the um, comments. If, even if you don't have anything specific to say, throw, in, throw in an emoji, throw in some horns. Um, just let me that let me see that. Let me know that y'all are watching. Um, let YouTube know that you're interested. You're, you're, you're commenting. You're throwing, you're interacting. The algorithm wants that. They want to know that that's happening so that they can maybe introduce me to a wider audience. I really appreciate everything you guys do for me. It really means the world. Thank you guys so much. I will talk to you next time.